good. All right. Good morning, everyone. <laughs> it is Wednesday, and uh, guys, seems like we haven't been here for like a month. Um, it was only like 10 days we were gone in California, but oh my gosh, it's all brand new again. <laughs> so, a um, couple things I want to talk about. Uh, first, our trip to California, we got so much great response from the live videos that we did as uh, uh, rudimentary and <laughs> whacked as they were. Um, I'm working on uh, doing something about the sound when I do those live videos, so uh, they didn't, the sound wasn't as good as I would have liked, but I'm going to fix that. So, um, and I really had a blast going around and meeting the people that, that we went and interviewed. So I, I want to, number one, say thank you to everybody for all the great comments and, um, and the emails and all that stuff. Uh, number two is I want you guys' feedback because, well, whether I get, uh, you know, super positive feedback or not, which everything's been positive so far, um, I'm definitely going to do that more. Uh, I am going to do that more. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick areas, and this is new to Vicky too, surprise. I'm going to pick areas that are within driving distance of us, and um, I'm going to go and, and meet with some of you guys. So if you guys are within, within driving distance of where I'm at, um, hit me up, uh, eric at makerwoodsign.com. If you're interested in me coming and doing some live training with you, I am absolutely open for it. Um, and we'll schedule it, try and schedule it when I can do. So I'm talking like the Phoenix area, the uh, Las Vegas area, um, maybe even LA. That's only about five, six hours away. Um, if you guys are open to me coming over there and just kind of doing impromptu uh, videos, live videos and uh, doing some training uh, on camera, I'm absolutely open to it. I'm definitely going to do more of that this coming year. So, um, sorry about springing that on you. I'm right, getting, we'll I'm talk, getting, we'll talk about I'm getting the stink eye from behind the camera. But anyway, uh, I'm definitely going to do it. Uh, whether Vic gets to come along for the ride, that I don't know. I can't speak yes, to that. <laughs> uh, I, I can't speak to that. So that's up to you guys. Her email is Vicky with <laughs> G, Vicky with Dave signs at gmail.com. Anyway, all right, let's get into the sign carvers of the day. Here we go. All right, so let's hope I got this. I, I've kind of got a new system bus, here, huh? Babe. It's a way what? to throw me into the bus. <laughs> All right, so here is one from Rich Tota. This is for his father-in-law's golfing group. His very first sign. <laughs> Freaking amazing. Unbelievable. Some of you first sign type, first sign carvers. Dave Orlando, this is for his wife, which I think is really cool. I don't know where these designs came from, but man, I dig them. Awesome. Yeah, really, really cool. Good job, Dave. Nathan Craft, and this is, again, a very first sign. Um, terrific, terrific. Great job, Nathan. Hope you're having fun with that. So this is from Albert Weinrich over in Germany. Weinrich? Probably Weinrich, actually. His very first sign. Albert's the one that made that video of the sign gallery uh, that I showed, uh, which is, was amazing. So this says, by the way, in Japanese, it says, um, says welcome in Japanese for his, uh, for his garden. This is for his garden. Zane Easley. Zane's been watching us for quite a while. So that's a that's a big one, I think. Yeah, great job, Zane. Joanne Willis. Her very first sign, or her very first big sign, excuse me. By the way, these are all from um, September, October, and early October. So we are getting closer to getting caught up. Jack Conrad. Conrad, I think. Conrad. Very first sign. I dig the whole Flintstones. He does mm -hmm. quite a few of these. I've seen several of these. I think that's a really good niche, by the way, especially for baby boomers. Yeah, I like that one. Yeah, this one's good. Julie and Robbie Strum. Strum. He spelled it wrong, I think. 
Huh? Sturm. It's it's actually Sturm, I think. S T U R M. I think it's Sturm. Yeah. Terrific From job. From New Zealand. From New Zealand, yeah. Mm -hmm. Thank you guys. Awesome. My buddy Andy Earl, check this one out. Gosh, I love what Andy does. Hold the corner of that up. Oh yeah. I love the stuff you're doing, Andy. Uh, he he just does so many different things in getting into staining and uh, does a lot of giveaways for raffles. Terrific job, Andy. Awesome stuff. All right, I'm not sure how to pronounce this. Maxime? Um, boy, I think it's French. Mm, nice song. I like Boyvert? I know that's not right. That can't be right. That's nice. Anyway, solid birch. Beautiful sign. I love it. Great job. I love the color of that board. Um, this is uh, Teofilo Salgado. I think he's over in California. And he did LED light face in, um, on this. And it definitely doesn't do it justice. I had other pictures, but this was the clearest one. Obviously an L.A. fan. Great job. Beautiful job. Phil Keen from Wexford, Ireland. Great job. And this one, I think, has a resin finish on it. That's what this is here. It shows kind of the, the shimmer of the resin finish. Beautiful job, Phil. Jeffrey Rivera, Pura Vida Creations. He and his wife are doing some amazing things. They're doing a lot of videos on Facebook groups. And uh, this kid is just a, a phenomenal worker. Just beautiful stuff. His signs have just, um, just absolutely a thousand percent better now than when I first saw him a few months ago. Just um, I love these this kid uh, and his wife. They just do amazing stuff. A lot of videos. All right. So this is this. I've actually had two pictures here. So this is his first sign. And I had mentioned to him about the N being upside down. So he, and this was for him, for his business. So here's what he did, John Pello, uh, Pelau. Um, he actually did this and taped it to that sign, which I thought was That's really clever. clever, really, really clever. I don't think he'll ever be doing another upside down N. But the N in that was upside down, in case you guys didn't see it. The N is upside down. Anyway, I think that's a fantastic uh, idea, John. Terrific. Um, all right, so this is Gary Brett, and this is actually a tabletop um, in a trailer. And it's uh, he put resin on it, and just I, I think it looks fantastic. Great job, Gary. All right. Rossi Badnik, very first sign. What's it say? Five by thirty-eight. Mm -hmm. Five by thirty-eight. Really cool. Really cool. That's a nice niche, the surfer community, and totem pole. Stephen Janice. Now this one's really interesting because Vicky and I grew up in Manteca, California. And in Manteca, California, there was a music store, and still is there, I think, is, I Janice see. Music. And I remember writing to Steve, and I think, was there Steve Janice? You went to school with know. the Janice clan. It's been a hundred years. Yeah, ago. but uh, it was really cool, and I remember telling Stephen that there was a Janice Music, and he shared it with all of his, um, uh, his relatives, which got a kick out of that. But anyway, beautiful sign, Steve. Stephen. Travis. Um, so here he mixed scroll working and router work, which I think it just came out really, really cool. Oh, that's nice. Beautiful job. Terrific job, Travis. Calvin Burnett. Nice board. I can't see it. Oh, yeah, uh, cedar. That looks like Western Red Cedar to me. Could be Redwood, though. Beautiful job, Calvin. Gorgeous. Rafael Rivas. <laughs> cool logo. What's it say underneath? I can't read it from here. USMC. Oh, USMC. Marine Corps. Of course. Should have known that. Great job, Rafael. Rafael, excuse me. Gary Zellner. 
Now, so this was um, another one for a band. He's done several of these. And that ball actually lights up. What? Was it yeah. too much shine? Mm -hmm. That bo red ball actually lights up. Terrific job, Gary. Cool stuff. All right, so this one, Luke 10, uh, 19. So the Luke 10, 19 reads, I have given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions to overcome all of the power of the enemy. Nothing will harm you. This is by that's Ruben awesome. Garcia. Really cool, huh? Yeah. That's yeah, cool. and I'm, I've never really heard of that scripture, but a really a cool image. Great job, Ruben. All right, Brian Hafner. So this is 20 by 20, and he put a backer on it. I think he put a plywood backer on it. Really looks cool. I think it's cedar. It looks like cedar to me with a plywood backer. Like the way he did the names there. Yeah. The letters. Yeah, really neat the way he put those together like a crossword puzzle. Okay. Is that what that's called? Like a crossword puzzle, right? Or Scrabble. Or Scrabble. Yeah, Scrabble. Terrific. Beautiful. Beautiful job. Uh, Doug Glenn. His wife actually did the, uh, the pyography of their dog on that. That's his seventh sign only. So she did the burning in it. I think it's called pyography, if I remember right. That's really, really popular these days. Great job, you guys. Travis Shadwick. First live edge. And that, that wood, by the way, is sassafras. Sassafras wood. That's a cool board. Never, never carved that before. I love the way that live edge looks. Isn't that cool? Mm, yeah, that'd make a nice oh, Vicky's got, uh, she's going to be out there looking for sassafras. I thought it was just like a drink or something. No, sarsaparilla. Oh, sarsaparilla. I always get those mixed yeah, up. So That's why the last time I had sarsaparilla, it got caught in my teeth. <laughs> it was sassafras. Anyway. Johnny Redding, first and second sign. Terrific job, Johnny. Great stuff. Perfect. Ken Wilson, very first sign. I'm still looking over the top of it. Was my hat in the way? Okay. Okay. Terrific job, Ken. Love it. Mike Ramore. I think it's Ramore. I like that. Look at that. I love that font. Yeah, that font is really cool. Very cool. I don't know what it is, but it looked it's very time consuming, but really looks very dramatic. Great job, Mike. For a first sign, crazy. Jerome Bowman. So this one is again a uh, very first sign, right? I don't quit. No, it doesn't say it's first sign. Sorry. Um, oh, that's nice. Love the image though. I don't know where that image probably found it on the internet. Probably. All right, that is it, guys. I think there's about 30 of them there. So we're not uh, like we did last time. We're not going to lay them all out. You guys can go back and, and review them. Um, hope you guys are having a great week. Uh, okay, so a reminder: Friday we're going to be doing our live uh, again. Going back to the doing our live broadcast on Friday. Um, we're going to call it. Friday Fun Q&A. That's what we got so far. Friday Fun Q&A with the Rotans. So that will be 6 p.m. Pacific Time, 7 p.m. Mountain Time, which is what Arizona is this time of year. And then wherever you're at, I guess in the east, it would be 9 p.m. So that will be live with me and Dad and Vicki. And um, we'll be answering your questions. So if you've got questions, you can save them till then. You can email them to me ahead of time. And I will try to get to them. Um, uh, and, you know, just be, be ready for us. So we'll be doing that on Friday. Um, I don't think we've got any videos planned between now and then as far as a live. But who knows? Something could come up. Um, again, guys. Appreciate all of you guys watching, all your support, everything that, uh, that you do for us. We appreciate it. Love you all, and we will see you on Friday. Bye.